Hey, Mark and Renee here. I'm going to release a little more about me. I'm just wonders what I'm like, what I do. Um, my favorite color is navy blue. Um, I love watching sunsets, sunrises. I love watching the movie. Oh, movie. <laughs> I love watching the moon. I just waking up and stargazing a bit. I can see the stars. Uh, let me see what else. Uh, favorite car or GT. Um, I'm just not making it. GT. Uh, let's see. Favorite thing to do. Uh, put in the stock and financial industry. The stock market. Um, favorite movie, Fletch. Uh, let's see what else. Um, favorite song, Crazy Seal. Uh, trying to think what else. Uh, do what color of eyes do I prefer? Uh, blue. I mean, green's fine, but blue. For my brown eyes. Uh, hmm. What else about me that people want to know? Um, favorite cult classic. Favorite cult classic. Um, I still say Fletch, but I'm not going to that one. Uh, Smoking the Bandit. That's kind of a cold classic. Uh, uh, I don't have a poster of, and this is true. Uh, just throw on the sweet first throw on the uh, Tech of the Color Tomatoes. We have a poster in my room. My movie poster. Uh, it's a horrible movie. <laughs> It's cheesy. It's just the cheesiest thing you'll ever see in your life. But sitting through it and watching it, knowing it's one of the first film and use uh, first it broke genres, and it's one of the first horror films to break a genre, and it's really cool to watch for that. But it is cheesy. It's you're kidding me. I sit through it every once in a while. Um. Favorite movie, favorite sci-fi movie, Star Wars, the original. You can't beat it. That type of popcorn, soda, it is bland. Um, favorite designer, hmm, probably Armani. Hmm. No, it's a toss up. Uh, Joseph Canali. I'm corrected to, correcting it to Joseph Canali. Oh, my face is itchy. I do apologize. I'm a little more casual on this than I would be in an actual interview. It's a nice thing about kind of social media ask for that channel. Um, I can actually just my face and I'll have to redo the whole thing. Let's see what else. Uh, time personal goal uh, to be partnered in a brokerage firm um, by the age of 50 I am 50 I don't know let's see if this happens I'm not getting into it uh, what else what else about me would people want to know um, how busy am I uh, I am so busy, I'm probably one of the busiest people in the world. I really am. I see busy all the time. If that comes out and I make a list, <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Of the busiest people, yes. That's Dr. Press comes out with all those stats. The Princeton's are corrected to the Princeton Press. 
and then use a copy of camera. Um, it's a Princeton Press, and they come out with all the stats. Supposedly, I remember doing math. Number one, and Todd didn't do that much. Fuck camera. Big reach. Uh, my lip was itch again. Um, that's about it. That's some basic facts about me that people didn't know. Uh, do I enjoy a great movie and actually swing by the movie house and get popcorn? Didn't take your ticket there. No, I'm not joking. Didn't take your ticket to the left of the concession stand. Just go in there and get a tub of popcorn while you're coming back with your video. Or if it's streaming, get your tub of pop popcorn, come home, and ta da, movie. Yeah, do something like that. To have a movie pop. <laughs> yes. Absolutely. Um, favorite city, New York. I think it's a big apple. I lived there for over seven years. It was closer to 12. Um, favorite place to live? Um, Probably New York. There's, I mean, there's towns that I enjoy being in that I've never lived. Um, but my favorite town to live so far is New York. And that should wrap it up. I'm going to wrap it up now. In the wonderful world of the end. I bid you adieu.